Hey you guys, welcome back to another episode of I Am TJ. This is going to be a video in my Glam Edition series. If you've been with me some time, then you know I do a Home Edition series, so I did promise to do a Glam Edition. We are going to make our first wig together, you guys. Wish me luck. So everything I purchased in this video pretty much came from Amazon. Let's start with this mannequin head. It's a 23 inch head that I purchased from Amazon. And the infamous dome cap that we're gonna be using to make this wig. I'm not sure if you guys know, but if you measure your head, you can go on Amazon and purchase a mannequin head that is the exact same size of your head. Um, you can go a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller, whatever you choose, but they do have the mannequin heads that are the same size as your head so that you won't do what I've done in the past, which is make a whole entire wig and it's too small and it doesn't fit. So I'm using the front of this dome wig um, where I'm pointing at right now. I'm using this to determine where I want to put the frontal in, where I'm going to um, be able to wear my middle part. So you guys, this is the frontal. Very nice frontal. It's a 20 inch frontal that I got from Amazon. I will have the information down in the description box. It was very thick, very full, very nice frontal for the price. The quality was awesome. This frontal, you guys, was only $59. So if you're interested, it'll be down in the description box. But if you're an amateur such as myself, because I am, I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't want to say that this frontal is pre-plucked, but I do want to say if you have no idea what you're doing, you don't know how to pluck a frontal, you could actually wear this right out of the pack the way that it is and get away with it. Or you can be a daredevil like I am right now and try to pluck it and make it a, make it look a little bit more natural. But um whatever you feel comfortable with just go for it girl i'm using these t-pins to secure the frontal where i think it needs to be sewn down again let me tell you guys i this is my first time buying human hair and trying to make a wig. I have purchased some synthetic hair and made a wig just to see if I knew what I was doing before I jumped out on a limb and spent some real money on this hair. So these C pins I got from Amazon. You guys, I just went ham on Amazon. I went on Amazon, I found everything that I needed. I put it all in the cart and I just bought it all. I didn't wanna have to go around to Sally's and all the different hair stores trying to piece together what I needed. Amazon had everything that I needed, so I just got everything from there. I will make sure to do my best to leave all of the information in the description box. So now that I have my frontal where I think it should go, we'll find out at the end of this video if I did a decent job or not. We shall see. But um, please don't come for me with sewing this thing down because I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know anything about hair. I really don't know how to sew weeds or anything. This technique is my own. This is what I came up with. And this is what's working right now. If you know a better way of doing it, please do go for it. If you're an amateur and you're new to this like I am, girl, we can mess this up together. So we're just going to see how this turns out.
So all I'm doing is sewing the frontal down from ear to ear, from left to right or right to left, which um, whichever way is, is going straight across is what I'm doing. I have it on, it feels like it's secure. I think I have it in the right place. So I'm trying to show you guys each angle, but I'm finished sewing it down. I'm combing the hair to kind of give you guys a view of how it looks once I sewed it down. And this is what it looks like. I sewed it all the way across. I was so hyped and so proud of myself. <laughs> um, I couldn't wait to get the rest of the hair in. This is a free part frontal, so you can part it anywhere, which was which was awesome. Okay, you guys, so let's get into this hair. I got this hair from Amazon. It is four bundles. Um, I got four bundles of hair, of hair for $166. Again, I got it from Amazon. This is everything that came in the pack. They give me these little cheesy lashes, but you know, whatever. Uh, um, four packs of hair, four bundles is what came in here. I got one bundle, 24, 126, and 228. I will have the link and the information for uh, which vendor I used on Amazon to get this hair. The bundles were nice. They were full. Um, they were a little bit thin towards the ends, but for four bundles of hair for $166, I thought it was awesome. The hair um, didn't shed too much since I took it out, so we're just going to rock with it. So here, what I'm doing is measuring the back, trying to put the first track as far down as I possibly can because that's what I noticed everyone else does, and that's what happens when I get my hair done. So I'm going to start with the first track all the way at the bottom. I'm going to sew it all the way across, and then all I'm going to do is do the same thing with every other track that I put in all the way up to the top until I get everything um, covered and completed all the way up to the frontal.
Okay guys, so I'm just, like I said earlier, we're just gonna continue to do this till we get all the way to the top. It's very easy. I know you guys have seen this done on other YouTube channels 15 times over. This is my way of tying a knot and closing out my string. I don't know how to do it any other way, so that's the easiest way for me. So now that we're done, I'm finished the whole wig. I'm going to cut out the cap so to expose the entire um, lace frontal so that um, I can try this bad boy on and see how we made out. What do you think, you guys? It's all done. I'm super excited about this wig. It came out so nice. I can't believe I did it. Um, I thought I wasn't going to have enough hair, but I had enough. Those four bundles in this frontal was completely enough, you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. Please join the IMTJ family. Hit the subscribe button. Do not forget to turn on your notification bell. Thank you guys so much for sticking in here with me. I love you. I appreciate you. And please stay tuned for more IMTJ Glam series edition videos. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family. The makeup look that I'm wearing in the beginning and the end of this video, I do have a video up. It's part of my I Am TJ Glam edition series also. So I will see you beautiful, beautiful people on my next video. Are you feeling my way? Cause I'm feeling your way. To pass up on it.